welcome back to Space Engineers. Now, this is technic ooh, technically three episodes ahead. Two episodes. But those episodes got... For some reason, my mic was just going like... Shh, the whole time. I think I fixed... Well, you'll know if I fixed it. After this. We are finishing up the rest of another miner. We have Salty Jones over there. And Salty Jones has a prank on him. So I need to just throw it. What color should Frank be? Salty Jones has a black Frank. So I'm thinking... Let's do a yellow Frank. I want a yellow Frank. A rat. His name is Frank. Yeah, Frank. Now, we have a small issue over there with the Dreadnought. As you can see, it is underwater. That's because it is too heavy. It is a fat bitch. It is a big girl. Big boy. Big boy, big girl. Ships are considered girls. Yeah. Yeah. I'm not sure. I think it is. I think it's a sh it would be considered a she. But either way, we're going to work on our miners. Uh, it... That... How do I word this? That'll sort its issue eventually. It just has to use up all the ice in it. Eventually, I'll just throw the ice out and break it on that way. What we're going to do this video is, well, paint and name this guy. Because that one, it's just so we can know the difference between the names. Salty Jones doesn't have any color changes. Salty Jones is yellow. I'm trying to think of a name for this one because right now, my biggest thing is getting that ship up. We need to expand our forces. Because the IMDC, even though they're not hostile, they are still well within range of claiming our area. Let's say they are getting huge swaths of land that they're patrolling and basically claiming as theirs. My fear is that they'll claim this and shoot down Salty Jones in terms of it, of him being in their airspace. So, to avoid that, Hopefully I can get this cruiser up, and then I want to get some kind of... I guess I could do that. Let's go base paint like that. Base will be blue. Not minding red at all. Right there. Crossed. And down the center. I want. I have a few plans what to do. Because. Oh, there's Salty Jones now. If they start taking off this area, we are well vulnerable to any kind of abuse they want to do. We can't do much to stop them. Their forces are well beyond. What we are capable of deterring. So best bet is try to not be seen. I guess is what I can say. As long as we're not seen, we'll be okay. Right, this text panel's got to go. It's in the way. There. I should have put a mirror line. Let's do that real quick. Oh, I can't. I can only do mirror lines in creative. Of course I can. Cool. That doesn't make this difficult at all. I just want it for painting. It's a decent paint job. It's not going to be amazing. Just so we can tell them apart. Now we're going to name this guy. What is this one going to be? Let's name you... Oh, 
What should we name you? We got Salty Jones. Bucket. Dave. You are Bucket Dave. Yeah, Bucket Dave. Alright, now we're gonna go and put Bucket Dave right here. Now I know I was gonna make them ooh, into four submarines, but the problem is they just don't, they can't handle the water. Okay, I'll show you real quick. One, if they go into the water way too quick, they uh, they impact like it's ground and it doesn't go well, which makes sense. Water is very rough, but if I was to go down, and I can kind of fight it if I'm doing it, but if it's not me, it, it does not fight it very well. Trying to go down, trying to go down. We're down here, but then it starts to tilt up. So the AI controllers are not able to do it. If I had, if I was controlling it, then I could. But right now I can't. But it is dark. I need spotlights or something on this thing. Let's see. Is there anything down here? How deep does this go? I've never thought about that. Oh, I can't. Let's see the bottom. Hello. Ow. It, it goes deep. All right. Yeah. No. It's it's still going down. Either way, let's just get out of the water. Here we go. And let's go up. Uh, hmm. I guess we'll just go over there where Salty Jones is and keep mining as well just because I don't have any good ore positions. A lot of them that I have seen are, are way out in the ocean. I'd have to make a mining platform, I think. I want to actually securely get ore from them. Right, let's park this. Let's go turn that off, go over here. Let's record a path. Oh, wait. Uh, program block. I want you to run. Or on? Is it on? Do I just have to recompile it? There it goes. Yep, good. Alright, now I can do it. Turn that on. Forward. And then. have to make sure they don't hit each other basically the moment they hit each other it's not gonna go well so I'm probably gonna just leave him here doesn't seem too bad I'm over forward down oh there's ice there it's totally not where a river is all right, now we're gonna stop. We're going to set up a mining job. So I don't have to worry about it for a while. We'll do that. All right. Now you're gonna do your job. I'm gonna fly back. Might catch a ride on Salty Jones to see how he's doing. But at the same time, I kinda don't wanna. That's that little bit. <clears throat> Let's look. Mm, there's more hydro control craft. I'm not a fan of them. This is slowly getting built. We're starting to get the at least the exterior. We have a lot of the interior done. I, think, I don't know how we're building this. We're like inside, outside, inside. Because this will all flood with water. This is all going to be flooded with water. And hop over 
here is all of our hydrogen engines. Hopefully working, but they're not taking in any hydrogen right now. Then we come right over here. Up, up, up. You've seen all this get built. Gyros are not built yet. That's so that's where the program block is gonna be. So it's slowly getting done. We do have all the guns down. So these are working. And I, we did have enough resources. I didn't have to take down the Dreadnought. But the Dreadnought kind of took itself out. So. It's, uh. It doesn't have any holes. It's just heavy. That's my guess at least. It's heavy. So it's having issues loading. And I have no real way of fixing that. Except for just really waiting. What I do want to get done is I want to get some kind of craft. At least like a scout craft. So let's do that. Get it black, and we want it to be digital camera. We are sneaky. Well, we can get going here. Move down. Then. Get 10. I think a 10. Now we need a cockpit. What is our longest cock? That's the cheapest one. We might just do that. Unless I get the rover one to be nice. Flat. That's rover. Regular. The Ideally, the fighter cockpit. But it's so long, and I think it might be taller. Really, it's that versus that. I'm thinking this. So I want it to be. What I'm looking for. Kind of stealth like. Having something that high up is not ideal. I could do a remote control, but then I'm limited on the range. So let's just do a... Let's do a fighter cockpit. Regular cockpit. Uh, fighter does have a large connection. I don't. I don't need large connections. Here's the problem. <laughs> Flight seats are only large. I need some kind of control block that isn't going to be too much. Let's get ramps real quick. Not ramps. We want... Try to work with a plane. That's an option. I'm looking for the more I think about it, the more I kind of want a helicopter. Helicopters are nice. We go propeller. 
Not propeller. What are they called? Blades. Let's go heavy. We're going the complete opposite of stealth at this point. Because here's my thought, all right? We can make like an Osprey or not a Chinook, but a, uh, maybe a Chinook. Something I can go out, find something, neutralize it in terms of weaponry. Get some lasers, have them shoot out the guns. Harpoon it, bring it back, grind it down. That doesn't sound awful to me. Sounds kind of nice. I need to do this real quick. Go over here, because I lost all my colors. Set current build color. Yeah. Hmm, that's not bad. But wanted to do a shortish episode because I did record like oh no these aren't here anymore all right we'll do that real quick uh, I did have a thing I was doing on a cubal deuterium reactor oh they're here oh but they're not right, either way I'm just gonna get rid of them because the one that I wanted is here. So that makes this a little bit more simple. Full. Inventory, inventory, full. Alright, now P, move, shift P. I want queuable ones, like that. And all we need is the steel plates to go in, and then I'll, after I queue these up, we will end it. Okay, my steel plates. Have steel plates? We got three thousand in a large container. One of these not hooked up with the rest. That's got some. Got some. Where is this one that has 3,000? Confused. Oh, wait, I know which one it is, I think. This one over here. It is. Alright. What we need to do is come over here and turn this back on. Finish it for me? Yes, it did. Awesome. All right, put that in. Now, what we are going to do is let go cubable processor and use stone. Okay. that. Yobel processor 2, we'll do it with the ice. Now I need to figure out how to tell my refineries to not do refineries. Can I tell you to not do stone? No, you're just gonna do it anyways. That's fine. Gravel, we'll get most of it gone. But I'm gonna end them on there and Hopefully I'll see you in the next one and not do the exact same episode again for the third time. Alright, you guys have a good one. Bye-bye.